what's up you guys it's Barbie and I'm back with another drink video so I want to take a second to let you all know if you're not 21 or older this video is not for you so please exit out of my video and come back when you're 21 thank you so much video so I got a lot of um, messages about you know making different videos of my drinking videos and I didn't really think that it was you know big deal like everybody knows how to make drinks or they just google it or whatever but apparently you guys want to see more so today i'm going to do a pina colada um which i really love and i actually got strawberry too just to add just in case you want to you know normally i just do pina coladas if somebody asks for like a strawberry pina colada i'll add some strawberry in it but it's very very easy um and simple ingredients so um you pretty much could use whatever um liquor you want but this um i got this uh bacardi mixers pina colada and it specifically says um bacardi rum so i got this bacardi uh white rum but you could i'm sure use whatever you like um so normally i only need a blender ice this bacardi and some cherries but i added uh the strawberry just in case you wanted to um, make it a strawberry pina colada so it's basic ingredients um and i normally get about four like uh these are nine ounces i believe oh no these are 12 so i usually get about four 12 ounce cups um i added six cups of ice already just to make it a little bit quicker um and before we get started if you guys are not subscribed to my channel please 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 take a second to go and subscribe i am so close to my goal and i really really need you guys to help me get there um so without further ado Let's get started. Bring it closer, make sure you guys can see me well. So again, like I said, I already filled this up about six cups of ice. And then this brand here, if you can see, it's a Bacardi mixer. I really love it. Um, I used to make it with just the, like the liquid stuff in the bottle, but when I found this, it tastes so much better. And I've gotten a lot of compliments when I make it with this. So you just dump the whole thing today. <laughs> and then it's pretty simple because then like the, the box tells you everything to do. And now it's saying with the rum to only fill this up halfway, I like a lot of alcohol. I don't know about you guys, so I fill it up more than halfway. Don't judge me. I normally fill it up about, I want to say three fourths cup of the way. Okay. And now, like, if you wanted strawberry, a strawberry pina colada then you could at this time you could go ahead and add some strawberry which i'm not going to do that i'm going to just do the pina colada and then i'm going to add some strawberry to the top and to the bottom of um maybe one of the cups just because you know not everybody drinks strawberry pina coladas so after that you just blend it and i have the the vitamix i don't know if it's pronounced vitamix or vitamix but this is the blender that I used. I used to use the Ninja. And I used to love the Ninja until I found out about this blender. And it is by far the best blender I've, like, I've ever had. Apparently, a lot of the ice cream places use it. It's a very, very, very expensive yet worth blender. It's amazing. happens let me get a spoon okay and for the record these drinks are for my household so I normally don't repeat like use a spoon more than once if I'm making it for other people but I'm making this strictly for myself and So what 
I was saying is that um, I'm going to use the same spoon because I usually test it, but I can already tell this is exactly how I like it. It's perfect when it's like you guys can see. It's not liquidy or nothing. This is how I love it. Mm-hmm. It's perfect. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay. So now I'll do one with strawberry. And you just, this is just the daiquiri margarita mix. And I'm not sure if I, yeah, I'll just put a little bit. So I'll just put a little bit at that bottom and then I'll put a little bit up, up top. And then I just fill these up. Mm, see that? Oh, I love how it turns out like that. Okay, so since this is the one I'm going to add strawberry to, I'm just going to look at that. Oh, yeah. Mm -mm -mm. So then I'll just put a little bit of strawberry up top. And then I always put a cherry. So that will be the only one I make with the strawberry. And then I'll just fill these ones up. So it, it does make quite a few. I think the package says like five eight ounces or something like that but these are these are 12 ounce cups might even have enough for more I'm used to I just love the way it turns out like it's not liquidy it's nice and thick I don't know about y'all but I'm thicker than a snicker that's how I like it it's definitely going to be more than just four. Whoa! Okay. I'm by no means a professional. Mm, 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 mm. I'm going to enjoy these tonight. Put a little bit more in this one. I think I could fill up another one. out because I don't like wasting my alcohol. Mm. Delicious. So I actually got five and then mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. delicious. So that is how I make a very simple pina colada or strawberry pina colada drink. Again, if you guys want to make strawberry pina coladas, you just add the strawberry into the mix. That's all. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up. And if you make your own drinks and would like me to maybe try it out for myself, or if you are interested in the drink, let me know. I'll get the stuff and I'll make it for you. It's just that simple. Um... If you're not subscribed, make sure you guys go and hit the subscribe button. I also have um, strawberry pineapple Hennessy drinks that I posted. That's a very popular one. And I also posted my shark, shark tanks. Um, that's a very you know popular one as well. Please let me know what you guys think. If you made it yourself, make sure you let me know how that went. Um, and stay tuned for my next one. Bye-bye.